Hello everyone and welcome to Alcala Technology. Again, today, the second chapter of the Alfa Romeo. Actually, this Alfa Romeo, we did a long time ago, where actually at the beginning we were talking in Spanish, then we swapped to English because you guys, um, which I really, really appreciate, you all want to, to have the videos in English. Um, well, what we did in the last chapter was the dashboard and the brake hand um, device, you can say. And today we're going to show how we repair the um, gearbox on that. And then we fit the engine again because this car had an issue uh, in a circuit actually. So too much reps and then the flying wheel uh, went out of the engine because the, the bolts were all cracked. And uh, yeah, so we need we needed to rebuild the gearbox again. So you will see this in the income video and yeah, and I will show you some things and parts of the garage maybe because we are always here and maybe we will show you where do we do other cars which, you know, don't take that long restorations as we take like these ones that we need to disassemble a full car. So as we always do different restorations, different things like fixing the, the soft tops and some other stuff or well some secret stuff that we also have there that you will sh see in a short future uh, yeah I will not speak much so enjoy the video and see you upstairs de lo que vamos a aprovechar de aquí va a ser las carcasas del cambio antiguo lo que vamos a hacer ahora es contar los dientes tanto del primario como del secundario de una caja y de la otra Vamos a, a revisar el diferencial trasero y vamos a contar también los dientes del piñón de ataque y de la corona. Sobre eso calcularemos la relación de cambio. ¿Eh? Eh, simplemente eso. Pensar que aquí va a ir todo nuevo, solamente aprovecharemos las carcasas y el resto del piñonaje y todo va a ir todo nuevo. Lo tengáis en cuenta. Hello again, I hope you enjoyed the way we were assembling and repairing the casing and all the stuff that was totally broken in this Alfa Romeo gearbox. So well, actually, this is another zone that we work where we do actually currently tires and everything. But here, for example, now we have another classic, 
which is a Lancia Tema, the 32 valves, which actually has a Ferrari engine. And well, you can see that we refurbish as the Rigazante um, color from Ferrari. And yeah, you can see here, because actually one hour ago, we were fitting the engine inside. So yeah, we did all the belts, we did, well, an R refurbish to, to make it work again. So for these little projects, we have different cars in different areas. Uh, enjoy what's coming next in the video, because maybe I will show you another secret. So yeah, here we are in a different area. Thank you very much for watching the video. I hope you like the, the, the end of the video. Um, I will show you another thing. Here we have some different parts from another project that you will see next week. So let me cover them as we are doing some other works in another area. And yeah, I'm gonna show you a little bit which car is it. So we have a Range Rover that we fully painted. We give a new wash of uh, face, we can say, because we always say it's a wash face of the car. It's for those cars that maybe a full, full restoration doesn't make uh, any sense because the value of the car will not reach the, the amount of money that cost to disassemble a full car. And yeah, actually, as you can see, it's looking really good. Now we need to fit all the parts, but yeah, you will see all the process next Wednesday and yeah, I'm willing to that. Thank you very much for following, for your comments, for everything, because we are receiving a lot of love from you. Thank you very much for everything. So see you next week.